Tonight, more fallout as Kentucky Utilities moves forward with its tree removal program in Lexington. Work continued today on removing trees along Lansdowne Drive a day after protesters tried to stop crews. One woman was even arrested for trespassing. Mayor Linda Gordon has said she plans to file a complaint with the Public Service Commission. Chad Hedrick reports. It's the sound of neighborhood treasures becoming uprooted. As Kentucky Utilities continued their tree removing program Tuesday, despite outcry from neighbors and the city. Our people have spoken here. People all over town are fired up about this. And they're distressed about it. I mean, people have invested a lot of money in their trees. Lexington Mayor Linda Gordon says the Irving County Council gave her approval to file a formal complaint with the Public Service Commission. She says the move comes after Kentucky Utilities has not shown the city respect when adjusting the program for Lexington's needs. This is a wonderful opportunity for Kentucky Utilities to come back to the city and sit down with us and have more conversation about how this can be done differently. A spokesperson with Kentucky Utilities told me they do respect the mayor's work, but it comes down to maintaining safety and reliability of the system. They say since they started the removal program, the frequency and lengths of outages has dropped 40 percent. We're asking for justification and we have yet to get it. Neighbors like Diane Atchison have protested the program and are critical of communication from KU, saying they don't feel their concerns were listened to. Today was a very down day. I watched them cut my favorite magnolias on Lansdowne Drive and almost collapsed. Um, and they, they paid no attention to us whatsoever. They Putting up a fight and hoping this move from the mayor can save other trees from falling to the ground. I'm just so hopeful that for all the people who care that this does come out with a much better outcome. Fox 56, 10 o'clock news. Kentucky Utilities says they do plan to replace every tree that is removed with a more compatible species to the line.